I'm really happy. Um, I've been trying to get a Grand Prix or Grand Slam medal for the um, last couple of months since um, being back from injury, and it's really good to be back on the podium and especially to be in the gold position. Uh, you had some really tough fights today. You beat former world medalist Ogata in the semi-final. Tell me about that fight and tell me about the final as well. Um, yeah, Ogata is um, one of the top judo players. Um, Japanese are always hard, obviously. Um, so I knew it was going to be a really tough fight, um, and I'm, I'm really happy with the win. And tell me about the final as well. Two scores for you in the final. Pretty convincing victory. Yeah, um, I never fought that girl before, um, so I wasn't 100% sure what to expect, but I knew she was right-handed, so I knew it was pretty much a standard right-handed fight for me. Um, and yeah, it was really good, some, some nice throws, um, so yeah, brilliant. How important is it for you, to, uh, confidence-wise, to get this win going into the World Championships later this year? Yeah, it, it's really, really important. Um, I've obviously medalled at this level before, but since my injuries, um, shoulder surgery and torn ankle um, since coming back from them I've medalled at uh, World Cups um, but I haven't been back on the podium in the last six months at Grand Prix or Grand Slam level so yeah it really really builds that confidence up I'm, I'm fully confident in myself anyway otherwise I wouldn't be coming out to these tournaments um, but it's really nice to just get that medal and put it in the bag. Uh, in 78s in Great Britain there are two really strong two of you now that are really strong how, how much does that help you having that there to work with and kind of push push each other um, it's a big help at um, sort of like national randori and when we have squad training um, she's a really hard competitor um, we have some good and horrible fights um, but I think it makes us stronger so yeah brilliant and uh, next for you what plans between now and the world and what are you hoping for at the world um, so I'm fighting next weekend at the British Open um, the weekend after that in Russia um, then we go to Germany the weekend after that for a camp um, and then we have another camp for, for our world prep down in um, Warsaw and then, and then it's the world, yeah. And um, I'm going there for gold. It's all I ever go for. I've never had a world medal before, so I'd be happy with any medal, but that's, that's not what I'm going for. I'm going for the gold. Perfect, Gemma. Thank you very much.